In this video tutorial, I will show you how to work with Sheets. The Sheets tab in Album DS shows the sheets included with the design. You may easily open a sheet by just double clicking at it. After saving a sheet, it is automatically included in this tab, but for this version, you may also add sheets by selecting a PSD file from your system. The needed .pg is created if not available. Please remember that only the path of the sheet is included in the album database. The PSD file remains unaltered in his folder. In this version, the sheets doesn't need to be in the same folder than the database, and you may even save each sheet in a different folder. Adding sheets may be done by dragging the PSD file into the Sheets tab or using the Add Sheets options from the right-click menu. Removing sheets is done using the related menu option, and as you may imagine, the sheets files are not deleted, only the reference in the album database is removed. In case you need to work the same album with different computers, or even different systems like PC and Macintosh, Album DS includes an option available at the Album tab to export and import a complete album. This creates a folder with all sheets and pictures ready to be imported at the target system. Sheets, like pictures, can also be previewed at larger size, but remember that sheets are sometimes large files, and it may take some time to load the preview. New sheet creates an empty sheet with the size provided at the album tab and placing the corresponding guides. The new sheet includes also a color fill layer for the background. Save sheet. By selecting this option, you will be prompted to input the sheet name and select a folder. Album DS saves the sheet in PSD and JPG format and optionally also in T format, if you have enabled this option at the album settings. Save as template. Saves the current design as a template in a subfolder of the templates folder in Documents Album DS. It is recommended to name the template at end with the number of places for pictures, for vertical pictures and horizontal pictures to allow the templates filter to work. I will explain more of this at the template section. Save as background. Saves the document currently open in Photoshop as a background in JPG format. Backgrounds have to be saved into a subfolder of backgrounds in Documents Album DS. Save as mask. Saves the open document in Photoshop as mask. Masks are JPG documents where the black area indicate hiding the picture and the white one reveal it. We recommend creating masks in a square format of at least 2000 by 2000 pixels for better fitting any shape. Save as clipart. Saves the document currently open in Photoshop as a clipart in PNG format. Cliparts are saved into the clipart subfolder at Documents Album DS. Resize to new album size. After introducing a new album size in the album tab, you may use this option to resize the sheet to this new size. Once resized, you have to save the sheet. A similar option is available at the album tab, but for the whole album. Rename files following this order. In this version, you may easily reorder the sheets in the Album DS Sheets tab by dragging the sheet thumbnail to a different position, but as you may imagine, the file name remain and therefore the order is not applicable to the sheets that will be sent to the lab. With this option, Album DS will rename the sheets using the order you have set and to avoid overwriting an already existing sheet, the date and time will be added always to the file name. 